निरंतर न्यूज अपडेट्स को सम चैनल नी सब्सक्राइब चाहिए पक्के उन्हें बेल सिंबल प्रेस चाहिए डम मर्ची पोखंडी गुड इवनिंग थैंक यू मिस्टर बन माली अग्रवाल थैंक यू विशाल थैंक्स टू सुकर्ण माय कोलीग इन द कैबिनेट द ट्रांसपोर्ट मिनिस्टर डॉक्टर पी महेंद्र रेड्डी एंड टू द all the distinguished uh, audience, ladies and gentlemen, and my friends from the media. I think all that needs to be said has been said. I don't really have much to say, actually. Thank you, uh, Banmali Saab and Vishal, uh, for actually choosing Hyderabad. In fact, Sukaran continues to grow his business in an impressive fashion, and I'm delighted that most of it is coming our way. Keep it, keep, keep it that way. Let's, let's not change that equation at all. Um, See, your, your local lads seem to like it, so you must <laughs> So, yeah, Tata Advanced Systems Limited, in fact, has been the principal anchor for the aviation and aerospace ecosystem in Hyderabad. And uh, among a list of marquee names, I'm extremely delighted that uh, GE has now joined this extremely, you know, uh, uh, elite list of uh, wonderful organizations which have made Hyderabad the base along with their joint venture uh, with the Tata Advanced Systems Limited. I had the good fortune of meeting the chairmen of both uh, GE and also Tata Sons. And uh, in fact, be it Mr. Ratan Tata or Chandra, John Flannery, everybody's been exceptionally upbeat about the opportunity of aerospace manufacturing in India. And their optimism, in fact, I'm delighted, that has now translated into something as high tech as elite, as, uh, as high-end, as Mr. Banmali has put it, as aero engine manufacturing. When I had a quick chat with um, John back in December when I had met him in Delhi, he had told me one thing and one thing alone. He said, our order book is full for the next five years for Leap. And he also told me that this is just, you know, uh, we, this is just the surface that we're really scratching. The opportunity not just in India and the Indian aviation industry to grow manifold is very much obvious and evident, but I think the opportunity to also make this the base to export to the rest of the world is also equally evident and equally upbeat. So my compliments to both General Electric and Tata's, Tata Advanced Systems Limited to be precise, on this wonderful partnership. The state of Telangana already has a very strong ecosystem as has been pointed out. We, all, we have two strong aerospace parks in Hyderabad today. In fact, we have five air strips around Hyderabad, which we are also trying to leverage and make more skilling academies and skilling institutions to supply the much needed manpower. In fact, we've entered into some very interesting partnerships with uh, academic institutions like Cranfield and also Aero Campus Acquainted. And we are looking to also upskill and also skill the man, uh, the students and uh, the workforce here in the state of Telangana so as to ensure that this growing ecosystem can be supported ably by the local workforce. So my compliments to the entire team and whatever that is uh, that is required from our side in making sure that the first engine comes out before December. That is fairly aggressive, I thought. But I have, uh, well, some of you guys are smiling, I guess. Um, but I, with the kind of commitment and with the kind of confidence that uh, has been shown here, because uh, groundbreaking happening a month after the announcement has been made, and now we are talking about an engine before the end of the year. Uh, it's fairly aggressive, but I think it is something that is imminently doable. So my good wishes and our wholehearted welcome. Thank you very much.